अ कॉमन नाउन इज द जेनरिक नेम फॉर अ पर्सन प्लेस और थिंग इन अ क्लास और ग्रुप इट इज अ नन स्पेसिफिक पर्सन प्लेस और थिंग फॉर एग्जाम्पल डॉग गर्ल एंड कंट्री आर एग्जाम्पल्स ऑफ कॉमन नाउन इन कंट्रास्ट प्रॉपर नाउन नेम अ स्पेसिफिक पर्सन प्लेस और थिंग कॉमन नाउन्स आर नॉट टिपिकली कैपिटलाइज बट देर आर टू एक्सेप्शन फॉर दिस रूल नाउ नेक्स्ट वी आर गोइंग टू अंडरस्टैंड अबाउट द प्रॉपर नाउन सो प्रॉपर नाउन Difference between common noun and proper noun is most important for the examination. So now we are going to learn about proper noun. A proper noun that identifies a single entity and is used to refer that entity, such as London, Jupiter, Sarah, or Microsoft, as distinguished from common noun, which is noun that refers to a class of entities and may be used when referring to instances of a specific class. For example, you can take. like uh, in common noun we can say i can't wait to start college this fall and in proper noun we can write i got accepted to ugla same like we can take example we are going to play baseball in the park in the proper noun we can uh, take example we are going to play baseball in prospect park in collective noun we can take a collective noun is a noun that represents a collection of individual usually people such as teens for example we can take 11 football players mother father and two children or etc okay in collective noun there are individuals usually people such as their teams now we are going to talk about abstract noun what do we mean by abstract noun so abstract noun are the words that name things that are not concrete for example we can take the word cat refers to cute animal we can see and touch the cat luck is the abstract noun because it refers to an intangible concept rather than a physical object that we can experience with our senses so that's it for today in the next video we are going to discuss many more important things like demonstrative noun interrogative noun and pronoun so if you have liked this video do like